can someone as smart and perceptive as you not realize that the person sitting right there is in love with you? I guarantee you I'm not the only smart, perceptive person to make that mistake. Clary, let me take you home. I don't think I have one anymore. What the? Clary, is there a war going on that I don't know about? There is now. No, 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 not you. Hey, we're a package deal. Yeah. There are runes all over the training room floor that would kill your Monday boyfriend. He's not I'm not, right. like, we're, we're uh, just friends. This is Alec. And I'm Isabel. Lewis. Simon. Simon Lewis. Yeah, this place isn't creepy. Not at all. Don't tell me you're afraid. <laughs> are you kidding? I was born afraid. Go be a badass shadow hunter, all right? Get your memories back. Save your mother. I'll be right here. You're like a yippy dog nipping at Clary's heels. I don't nip, and she's my best friend. That's all she's ever going to be. Mother wants me to be a CPA. What do you want? Me? Um, well, I'm, I'm in a band. Have you seriously not figured that out yet? I've seen every horror movie ever made, and the funny best friend who gets left behind... <gasps> dead man. I'm afraid Simon's coming with us. How does this end? Clary and I have always had each other's backs. Don't worry, my little caramel. We had our entire lives. Everything will be just fine. <laughs> thank you. Go! I don't know how to thank you. Don't thank me. You mean nothing. You know I'd do anything for you. You don't have to die. I'd rather not do that. <sighs> I don't know how to explain this, okay? But I think, I think these are my people. Message received loud and clear. I want to flat out say I'm sorry. I feel like crap for leaving you with Chase and those guys. This should be invisible to most mundanes. When did you get the sight? What happened to you at the Vampire Hotel? Nothing. Um, Clary. I need to talk to you. I think I need to talk to you more than I've ever needed to talk to you in my life. Just give me a second. I know. Simon, this is really not a good time. I know you're busy saving your mom, but... I think I'm becoming a vampire. I'm still a human. Well, of course you are. <laughs> or at least you would have been. You look like you're dying. What? <laughs> please come back, please. Clary, you, you're the last person I'd ever want to leave in this world. He won't return alive or breathing. He'll be a vampire. If you decide to bring him back, just know that his journey won't be easy. So make sure you do it for him, and not yourself. My mundane's a fighter. Survived the vampires at the Hotel de Mort. Survived the werewolves, the Jay Wolf. Survived accounting, whatever that's worth. Break up. Clary, what's happening? died. Hey, what? Am I a vampire? Yeah. Clary, tell me. Tell me this isn't real. Tell me this is not really happening. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm repulsive. Please, please, don't say that. Stay away. You did this to me. No, I did it. You're a monster. Nothing more than a monster. I'm a monster. Look, you gotta get this under control. You are where you are now. What would I do if anything happened to you? Simon! Take care of my boy. You know how much he means to me. See you later, Mom. I almost tore my mother apart. Simon, it was my choice. Clary, why? Because I love you, Simon. You call that love? You brought me back to this? This nothing? Where I feed and I have to hide from the sun and I can't bear to be by the people that I love. I can hear your heartbeat. I can smell the blood in your veins. And I want it. Please understand. I... Stay away from me. You're a shadow hunter. He's a vamp. You two will never be equals. I never wanted any part of any of us. At least you're a superior being. I'm a downworld. I understand if you hate me now. Hate you? Never. 
I don't want to bite you anymore. Well, that's good. Every downworlder seems to despise shadow hunters. We'll see. We'll get better. Can't you see the divide? Not between us. If our newest member pledges his loyalty to his new leader and joins our clan, we'll all stand beside you. Simon's not a pawn. No, but I accept your deal. Simon, what are you doing? Whatever it takes to protect the downworld. It's my world now. I guess I should expect people to hate me for who I am now. I'll get used to it. Never get used to it. You hear me? Got a lot of stuff to work on here. We'll see each other soon. Simon, listen, I... What's done is done. I'm a vampire. And you're a shadow hunter. Goodbye, Simon. I don't know if you know this, but I thought I found... You know. I mean, it doesn't matter now. I just want to go home. You can't. Not until you control your impulses. You understand me? Welcome home. I'm over it. I guess I'll just always be alone. Emotions running hot. Anything and everything makes you want to vamp out. It's like, it's like going through puberty all over again, just with less sits. Simon. Stay where you are. Simon, no! I was ready to rip his throat out. Simon, wait! Clary and Jace are brother and sister. That means, that means they can. I need your help. Once we open this, there's no going back. I'm disappointed in you. Everything we've done to unite the downworld goes out the window. Our alliance is finished. Simon's betrayed us. Whatever you do, don't lose hope. I love you, Clary. Love you too, Simon. A lot, a lot happened while you were away. You're a vampire. So are you worried about Jace? Or maybe telling Clary how you feel? You're the worst vampire ever. Welcome to your new home. I'm enjoying our together time. <laughs> it's ridiculous how crazy our lives have gotten in the last few weeks. I'm still trying to figure out this whole vampire thing, and Luke says I should remain among downworlders. You're so. not going to figure anything out. Look at you. You're an embarrassment to your own kind. You're a vampire, Simon. You're tougher than you think. You're a vampire, damn it. It's time to man up. Everything, everything's gonna be fine. You're gonna be fine. I haven't heard from you in a while. I, I just wanted to make sure everything was okay. Your mom will grow old while you stay the same. And eventually she'll be gone. Clary, my mom's missing. She's drinking again. Oh, no. If anything happened to her because of me... You better care of your mother. I know you feel horrible if anything were to happen to her. You died. I was wrecked. You were? Luke, Clary needs you. I could use you too. <laughs> oh my god. <clears throat> Is this blood? Flushing this down the toilet. No, Becky, please don't. Don't take. No, don't, 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 please. No, no, wait. I don't know how much longer I can control myself, okay? This is not a normal person problem, okay? Simon, I'm your mother. I'll always love you, no matter what. I'm a vampire. Oh, you're serious. I, 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 know, I know this sounds totally insane to you, Mom, but please, please, just, just you have to believe me. Simon. Be consequences, amigo. What, what do you mean, consequences? She doesn't remember you coming home. You did not strike me as a jealous type. Maybe I'm just getting tired of you leaving your stink around here. This is me leaving. I'm just about packed. Looks like you barely moved in. Do you always talk this much? When I'm nervous. Why would you be nervous? It's just my natural disposition, I guess. I'm, I'm Simon. Maya. Who's Clary? Hmm? Luke's kind of daughter. Oh, Clary. Um, we met in first grade. Ms. Hiddleston's our class. She ran to get the nurse when I had an allergic reaction to Clay. So naturally, we've been best friends ever since. Luke, it's me, Simon. The guy you taught to shave. Go with the grain, right? Yeah. Simon, what you did back there with Luke, that was, like, seriously inspiring. Really? I I don't think I've ever inspired anyone before. 
you have plans? Yeah, I'm hanging out with uh, Maya. It's okay, right? No, that's unacceptable. I am your only friend. It's in the bylaws. Come on. What's wrong? Nothing. Who are you talking to, Frey? Come on. Something's up, I can tell. You know, I didn't think hot tempered wolves were your type, Simon. Maya? No, we're just, um. Friends. It's the Simon Lewis sweet spot. You're the safe choice, Simon. You're non threatening, you're easy to talk to, and you never seal the deal, am I right? Stop being myself. Exactly. I keep fighting it's never gonna work. And all I wanted to do tonight was prove to myself that I'm not in love with your best friend. Why not just tell Clary how you feel? What if I tell Clary and Every single it ruins our friendship? What if you don't? It's gonna be funny. You fought a cobra. You, you went to India. You can, you can tell me. It's Clary. Simon, are you yeah. okay? We've been friends. Best friends for a long time. And the last thing I ever want to do is screw that up. Because it's it's really important to me. Yeah, it's, it's really important to me too. But the, the thing is, when two people are friends, people like, like you and me, sometimes feelings evolve. I'm in love with you, Clary. But I realized that you, know, you might not feel the same way, and it, it might get weird, and that it might, or it might be. This news of a downworld apocalypse—it's it's not all bad, because now it's clearer than ever. I want to spend every minute of every day with you. <laughs> Ow! What the hell? Hey, it's me. I don't know. Yeah. Think about it. I mean, the dashing, handsome Jewish boy finally admits to his best friend how he feels after a lifetime, and she dies a week later. It's too sad. I'm so glad. You and I. Just a little longer. Don't go. Clary! Clary, run! Brave and stupid. Your vampire boyfriend here is gonna die death. I wouldn't wish upon anyone. Simon, please. Once I started beating, I couldn't stop. I'm really sorry. Simon, you're okay. How? Huh? It's a surprise. What are you doing? The sun's up. You can't. Wait, Sam. How? <laughs> oh. I mean, does it matter? <laughs> <sighs> it's funny how normal doesn't even feel normal anymore. I'm not even a normal vampire. I'm a freak of vamp nature. You are not a freak. Don't you realize you have what every downworlder wants? Winning personality, you noticed. The chance at living a normal life. Headlines, I'm going back to NYU, majoring in, wait for it, <laughs> music. What's wrong? Everything okay? Yeah, um, it's just that Jace, Jace, you know, he's still spinning. About the soul sword attack? That and finding out he's not really Valentine's son. That means Jace isn't Claire's brother. Simon, I, I thought you knew. Why didn't you tell me? All I want to do is go to college and hang out with my girlfriend. Is that too much to ask? We want to be in your clan. Uh, I don't, don't have a clan. I'm a music major at NYU, so. For centuries, we've heard the legend of how one day a great leader would come. A vampire who can walk in the daylight. I'm Simon Lewis. Thank you all for coming. Um, this is for the downhill. Last chance to turn back. Wherever you go, I go, Fred. Simon has proven himself a worthy warrior and a loyal friend. I feel darker times are coming, Simon. Shadowhunters are all alike. Their mortality makes them fickle, selfish, weak. In the end, they always choose their own kind. And so must we. I can't speak for all Shadowhunters, but I know Claire is nothing like that. She would never turn on me. The kiss that will set them free is the kiss you most desire. Clary, just kiss me so we can go home. You can fool.
for yourself, but not the Vitus Veritas. I told you, Daylighter. They always choose their own kind. Your Highness, are we free to go? Oh, yes. It seems one of you already has. Simon, let me in! The better days. How's that? Day or night, your heart can still get... Shattered. Don't worry, this will make you forget your sorrow. I see the queen made you reveal who you desired most, and it wasn't me. It was Jason. I love you. Why? Because you don't mean it the way I mean it. Ever since we were kids, I've been in love with you. Now the Seely Queen had asked me that question, kiss the one I most desired. No one would have even come close. Trying to be more than friends. It was a mistake. Clary told me what happened. Listen, I just want you to know, whatever's going on between you two, I'm always here for you. You're the closest thing to a son that I got. Whether you like it or not. I think I killed him one day. Maybe I don't know myself anymore. I... You're under arrest for the murder of Heidi McKenzie. You! I'm telling everyone, Luke, the Shadow Hunters! They didn't kill that girl. Are you okay? No, not really. We promised that we would always be friends. No matter what. I can't imagine a world without you in it, Frank. Me neither. But I need time. Nobody said being a down older would be easy. We all make mistakes. Especially when it comes to love. You just need something to clear your head. It's the Jewish Day of Atonement. Essentially, you don't need anything to atone for your sins for the past year. And judging on my last year, I have a lot to atone for. We've been over this. For a downholder, depression can be seriously dangerous. What if you end up hurting somebody? My family's all I've got left. I need to feel normal again. You know, even if it's for a few hours. Are you going somewhere? Yeah, I'm coming with you. You know, I think it's time for our Yom Kippur tradition where we share what it is we're atoning for. Thank you for coming tonight. Despite my many objections, I could not have gotten through that dinner without you. I mean, I had a lot of fun at your family dinner, but just as friends. Simon, you can't possibly be that clueless, okay? She likes you. It's obvious. She doesn't like me. I'm done chasing girls who only want to be my friend. I didn't take you for a quitter. Maya! Hey. I'm not good at the whole trust thing. Letting people in. I'm not good at the whole giving up thing. Things like going to class, boyfriend, girlfriend, they feel very... Mundane. Yeah. Simon, we need to talk. Yeah. I miss you. I miss you too. You know I always have your back, Frank. And there's no job that's too big. I need you to talk to the ceiling. You want war. I want change. And you, Daylighter. Join me in my court. Give me what I ask, and I shall grant you whatever your heart desires. Thanks, but no thanks, Your Highness. You've refused me twice now. No one in my very long life has ever dared do such a thing. What would the Queen want with Maya? She has this crazy obsession with me because of the whole Daylighter thing. Luke, if something happens to Maya because of me... I'm not gonna let that happen. Where is she? Safe and sound. Let her go. Now. You came too. <sighs> Simon is quite valiant and chivalrous. Unlike any of the other night children I've ever known. I need you in my world, Simon Lewis. You have to tell me. Uh, tell you what? Why the Seely Queen let us all go? I knew you were a man of your word. For better or for worse? We are going to have so much fun together. Your time has come, Daylighter. Time for what? What's that? Look. I don't know what's happening. It's happening here, but I'm not going anywhere until you tell me what's going There's on. There's no use resisting. Your powers do not work in my realm. The hurt will be over before you know it. 
you're free to leave. Really? And remember, though you walk in the daylight, darkness will follow. What did she want with you? I'm not sure, really. It's bad enough when the vampire is just sleeping. You're shacking up with him. We are it all smelling. It. It's disgusting. I want to be with you. We're here to help you move out. Permanently. Seriously? I mean, pretty sure it was you wolves that put me there in the first place. Simon, watch out! <gasps> what just happened? You are in the daylight darkness will fall. I guess I just missed the days when our biggest problems were 90-pound bullies and the threat of being suspended. Raphael, I need to talk to you. Your little lost boy act doesn't work with me, Lewis. If you knew me better, you might find I'm actually pretty lost. <gasps> Simon, it's not worth the risk. I have to get this thing off you before I kiss him. We're going to figure this out. Just try not to piss anyone off and we'll deal with it in the morning. Simon, I, uh... It's okay. I'll come by tomorrow and, uh, pack up my stuff. I don't want to cause you any more trouble. So you're abandoning Simon? I just need a place of my own. I, I don't want to have to explain why I have a fridge full of blood or how I never eat. Whoa. Uh, Are you okay? Uh, I got a van. I'll give you a ride. This says New York is not friendly. Thanks, man. Yeah, you got it. I'm Simon. Kyle. I'm this way. <laughs> hey, do you know anyone who needs a place? Okay, this is going to sound weird, but I, I was actually looking for one. Relax. Make yourself at home. My last place wasn't homey and... I had difficult neighbors, so I really appreciate that. Thanks for calling it in, but I told you to keep your distance. Well, I didn't like the way things ended up with me and Simon the other day, so uh, I thought I'd stop by tomorrow and, and check on him. Lay off while I do my job. Simon Lewis belongs to the Praetor now. What happened? It's a long story. You know, everyone kind of hates me at the moment. Who are you? I live here. Who are you? You're telling me this guy almost runs you over and then he just stop? happens to have a room in his apartment stop? and that just happens to be full of all your favorite stuff. Yes, I guess I just got lucky. I don't believe in luck. Jeez, what the hell? <laughs> Get off me! Your friend Kyle here is a werewolf. You've been lying to me this whole time? I'm prey to Lupus. It's a secret organization of wolves. Guardians. We heard about the blast of energy Simon unleashed on the Lucian Grandmark's pack. I was sent in to assist. I don't need someone to protect me. I need people to tell me the truth. Well, I was going to tell you the truth. And the time was right. You need to calm down. Whose side are you on? I don't agree with his tactics, but Kyle did apologize to you. I understand the situation isn't perfect. But if someone's offering you help, be a fool not to take it. I'm not over the fact that you lied to me, but I'm willing to give you a chance. You want to help me? I'm in but only on my terms. That's not how the Praetor works. That's too bad. I'm still gonna go on living my life. I don't, I don't think we've met. Are, are you one of Kyle's friends? Simon, it's me. I thought you were dead. Yeah, not anymore. Thanks to you, sire. You're the one that gave me life, Simon. And now we're bonded. We belong together, Simon. By the way this girl's reacting, doesn't sound like she has anybody. You're right. I can't just walk away from this. I, I'm, I'm so sorry you had to go through all of that. And for my part in it, I'm here for you. Oh, no, no, that's... that's so that's not what I meant. I have a girlfriend. That's... that's... Huh? <laughs> you didn't... You didn't see the look on her face. What if she comes after you? I'm not leaving your side. Hey, stranger. Hey. Wanna talk about it? Not really. His, but wait. You know this vampire? Her name's Heidi. I'm her sire. I'll make sure she never hurts anyone again. I'm sorry. What? I'm sorry. I did the right thing. Why doesn't it feel like it? Hey! 
Are you okay? What happened? Where did you end up taking high? He's the werewolf who turned me. You go. You're Jordan? I'm such an idiot. No, it's, it's no, 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 no. I've heard enough. Just stay away from both of us. I'm your best friend. You don't have to go through this alone. Simon. You can talk and I can just listen. Believe it or not. Whatever you need. I just need to be alone right now. I haven't been here since taking a kid to work there. I need you for a reconnaissance mission. Me? Why? You broke the bones of a wolf and nearly killed a vampire with that thing on your head. I had a guy helping me figure it out. He was like my supernatural life coach. He says he works for this top secret organization called Crater Lupus. I'm the one that called him in the first place. <laughs> what the hell happened in here? I'm not going on a demon hunt with my best friends in prison. Simon, Clary risked everything to save Jace. You want to do something for her? Help destroy the demon that caused all this mess. I just have to hunt down the queen of hell. Well, I'm coming with you. I didn't need to burden you with all this while you're dealing with the whole, you know, Jordan thing. It, Clary's the one that we need to worry about now. Jordan and I talked. He left me to fend for myself. I'm not going to let him do that to you. So you you blasted Lilith's henchman into something. Not on purpose. This thing just goes into high gear around demons, I guess. You just gotta trust me on this. I do, but please, isn't there anything I can do to actually help? Yeah, stay on track with Lilith. <laughs> I got you. I got you. I got you. It's okay, Maya. You're safe. Just... Everybody just... Leave me alone. Going somewhere. I just need to get away for a while. I just need some time. Can you give me that? The prey to finally determine what the symbol on your head is. The mark of Cain? Whosoever slayeth Cain shall have revenge taken upon him sevenfold. God cursed Cain for killing his brother, so Cain would have to wander the world in misery. What if we use the mark to break Clary out of prison? No one can stop me. I'm basically invincible. I, well, let's just think this through. Any soldier that came at you would be blown to bits. You really want that blood on your hands? Do you remember the mark of Cain? I know how he got it. I just want to know, how did he get rid of it? He never did. That's, that's, that's fantastic. Thanks, thanks anyway, Rabbi. Such a precious little baby. I could look at these photos all day. You're at my house? Don't hurt them. I'm the one who tricked you. I'm the one who got you sent away. It's my fault. There's nothing you could ever do that would make me love you less. Can you say the same about them? Of course. They're my family. They'll always love me. You're living half of a life. Simon is a vampire. What's your game plan? You're gonna make me feed on my family and then what? And then we'll be free to start a new life together. Dude, what makes you think I'd even want to do that? You don't deserve my love. You're nothing to me. You're just trash! Do it. Move the place, do it. You almost had me, but she wore me back a little more. Simon, are you okay? <sighs> Simon! Quick. <laughs> You get away from her! Don't you touch her! You are not my son! You're a monster! Get out! Get out! This isn't your fault. Heidi manipulated and tortured you. I'm the one who fed on my own sister. I'm a monster. No, you're not. You're a good man, Simon Lewis. And we're gonna get through this together. How long is it until I turn? You have to have died with my blood in your system, then get buried. Oh, Simon. You went through all of that alone. You died. I'm your big sister. And I'm always gonna love you. Words, things, 
So please don't kill me. I'm all your sister has left. It's okay, it's okay. It was an accident. In his last moments, he thought about how much he's gonna miss you. And no matter where he ends up in his next life, he will always love you. Simon Lewis is dead. I know the timing sucks, but we need you. Lilith has Clary. No. And the one thing aside from Clary's sunlight room that has proven to work against Lilith's disciples. No, Mark. I just lost my mom. I'm not losing Clary, too. Hey, miss me. Hey. Lilith was afraid of that mark on your head. It's defensive, not offensive. We'd have to get her to make a run at me, but she's more than that, isn't she? Not when it comes to her son, she isn't. No! Hey, it's me, it's me, it's me, it's me. Where is she? Where's Clary? I killed her. Clary's dead. The glass came from my forehead. And if I didn't try to play hero, Clary would still be alive. I know how hard that must have been for you, but it was an odd time to take off. You're gonna get any better if you stay inside of the door. You don't understand. I'm dangerous. Only when someone tries to attack you. Clary didn't try to attack me. She... I need to talk to you about Simon. Is he okay? After what happened with Clary, he's terrified about his mark, paralyzed by it. Poor Simon. And Clary and Simon have been best friends since they were kids. I want to find a way to help him get rid of this mark. I'll be a better man to if it weren't for Raphael, I'd still have a family. No excuses. What I did to Heidi was reprehensible. And all the things she's done to you. I need to get this mark off my forehead. The one that almost killed you. I'm desperate. There's a legend. A vampire who lives in hiding in the sewers in New York. How do you know this guy actually exists? Aren't all the legends true? Call me if you find him. Or if I don't, I think I see something. Simon, wait! I just want to ask a few questions about this thing called the Mark of Cain. My dear boy, I am Cain. Imagine what it's like, cowering at the center of an angry mob. Waking up in a sea of bodies. Trust me, I just, I just got this thing and I know it. exactly what you mean. No one's gonna get hurt. I just need to get this off. Quinn will know what to do. I attempted to remove a ritual once, but I was too afraid to die. I see you have the proper trinket. But do you have the courage? You won't know how you'll react until you stare death in the face. Simon, please, it's not worth it. To make sure no one I love ever gets hurt by me again, it is. And you, Becky, my love. And keep an eye on my mom. You're gonna make it. I did warn him of the danger. So much more to live for. It's okay. It's okay. I can't look into my eyes. Okay. I could have died. You would have done the same for me. I honestly don't know what I would do without you. That's what family's for, Frey. 
The hunt for Heidi's going horribly wrong. I don't have the mark of Cain anymore. Oh, you know what that means? Yeah, back to being normal fur vampires. No, you you don't need a predator. Heidi's my responsibility. Invincible or not. I'm helping you bring her down. There you are. What's up? Heidi's back. So much has happened since we last talked. Simon, I am so glad you're back to your old self again. You deserve someone who will love you. The heart and soul. Right, it's okay. What we had was amazing, right? With the whole shadow world against us, we proved to them that a wolf and a vampire could be together and be happy. It's pretty cool. But what we had, it's changed. And we both feel it. And it, it has nothing to do with the shadow world. It's just, I don't know, it's just, it's just, it's just humans. You're an amazing guy. Did you know that? Apparently Jordan lost his cool on a raid at the Hotel du Mar and when they wall. It's a massacre. Maya? Simon. Heidi has to pay. She will. I promise. I'll kill her myself if I have to. I won't come to that. I'll see you in hell. The world is a better place without her. But that doesn't make this okay, Maya. There's a system for a reason. And if we keep breaking the rules, what makes us better than her? Watching Alec fall apart over Magnus, I'm not sure I want love in my life. Not if it hurts like that. Hmm. Let's make a pact. Single for life. What is that? It's pinky swear. This is the most sacred vow anyone can make. I love sacred vows. Let's do it. Guilt never fades. Sometimes, to overcome your demons, you have to face them. Izzy. I need your help to save Clary. Of course. Whatever it is, I'm in. Good. Now I'm placing you under arrest. Santiago. Rafael Santiago. Please, take me! Stop! It's my turn. No! Where's the heavenly fire? So what? You think a couple of runes makes you better than the rest of us? Why are you really here? I told you. I'm a natural born killer. I'm human. I gotta get that heavenly stuff to save my friend Clary. Hello, Simon Lewis. Okay, you got me. My name's not Zeke, and I didn't kill anyone. I just need the heavenly fire to save my best friend's life. Putting your life on the line for the people you care about? It's pretty badass. I don't really want to go out tonight. Simon, it's tradition. When have you, me, and Frey ever missed a Halloween together? Clary can't tonight. She's on duty at the Institute. The Shadow World is a very dangerous place. I've sworn off love. <laughs> oh, come on. You are the biggest hopeless romantic I know. No, I'm serious, Becky. I'm, I'm not the same Simon anymore. Everything's different now. Now that Mom and I live in Florida, I just want to know that you've got people looking out for you. You're totally into Isabel. No, no, no. We are just friends. Oh, like that stopped you before. She's never going to see me that way. I may not be a shadow expert, but I know romance. And there's something between you two. Just the two of us. Alone. Uh -huh. Simon, why are you being so weird? I'm not I'm not being weird. It's because of something Becky said. She said something that you know got gotten in my head. See, that's the fun in it though. The hot girl doesn't see the geeky guy with glasses until the hot girl realizes that the geeky guy is totally awesome. She just saw him for who he really is. I get wanting to go back. I almost killed my sister and I had to make my mom believe that I was dead. Oh, I 
five lives that have been destroyed. I'm just trying to save Clary's. What, what, what's more important than bringing Clary home? Luke! Clary! Stop! Simon, cheap shot bringing my best friend. It wasn't part of the plan. Super villain is not a good look on you, Frey. Trust me. This is who I am. You and I both know that's not true. Stand down, or this Kindle finds its way into Simon. If you do that, Clary, that's a choice you're making. A choice you're gonna have to live with every day for the rest of your life. <laughs> Simon, I told you to stay out of this. You could have been killed. Well, I'm not a shadow hunter, so I guess I don't have to listen. Like a hope that fuels the light. Simon, get like down! <laughs> I'm getting seriously tired of saving your life. I am not. Uh, Izzy? Uh, Is? When Glorious exploded, it saved my life. How could I not? I should. No, yeah, you should. Uh, sorry. Beati Bellicosi. Blessed are the warriors. I just want to be someone. Blessed are the peaceful too. Given how everything happened, I know the last thing you want to do is listen to a vampire. But Jordan was my friend. Things mattered to Jordan. People. Cheers to you, mate. You mattered to us. Life is short. You can't be afraid to open your heart to the people that you care about. What is that for? Is he? For being you. I guess Lois just needed some time to see what was right in front of her. Life is too precious to waste any more time on stupid things like pinky swears. Such an attractive couple. How long you two been married? <laughs> <laughs> no. No, we're just friends. Big mistake. Is he? Is he? I didn't set her on fire, we were just kissing, and then... You were kissing my sister? I mean, she was kissing me too. I'm gonna be fine. Thank the angel. Wait, am I not allowed to say that? The heavenly fire from when the sword exploded. Until it leaves my system, I can't touch anyone with demon blood. What is going on here? Isabel and Simon were kissing when this happened. And Mr. Lewis, Royal Blue himself. I can't appreciate a good melody when I hear one. Whoa, whoa, Izzy! Given the chance, would you go back? Izzy, you okay? Relationships. Everyone that I've been in has magnificently imploded like the Death Star. Why don't we try to learn to be better together? I've never seen my brother as happy as he is when he's with Magnus. I know the feeling. Gonna ask for a better man. I just want you to know that having you as my best friend, it, as kids and during our adventure in the Shadow World, I don't know what I would have done without you. Why does this feel like some weird goodbye? Uh, can I go get sentimental? By all means, get started. How's your book coming along? Ooh, I finally came up with the title. Unseen World, The Divine Implements by Ezekiel J. Russo. I wish I could use my name, though. But Clary would be really excited to see that the uh, graphic novel we started working on so long ago was finally finished.